Agent of Sync Army. Okay. Agent of the Sync Army. That's an interesting name. Um, anyways, uh, to answer your question, I think that... Okay, first of all, yeah, I've never lip synced in my entire life. So let's just get that out of the way. That's bullshit. Um, I don't agree with anybody lip syncing to their music. I say that if you do it, you should be able to uh, reproduce it live or at least try to reproduce it live. I mean, every singer has their freaking bad nights, man, for sure. And it's, it's hard to reproduce or replicate exactly what you did in the studio at times just because it's human nature. You get tired, you get sick, you're worn out, burnt out, whatever. Um, but yeah, so... That is off the board. No lip syncing whatsoever for whomever you are. I think that's bullshit. Um, as far as backing tracks, I think it comes down to when you utilize the studio's environment to be able to create something within that song that is glorious and, uh, you know, multi-layered vocals or instruments that, um, you know, that are beyond the core instruments used within that band. I think it's cool because it can be very enhancing. And so when you decide to play those particular songs, you have to either ask yourself, it's going to be the bare minimum and it's going to be a little more raw than it was in the studio or the studio's version, or you're going to want to give your audience everything that they've come to, um, you know, uh, familiarize themselves with while listening to that song. They associate those, all those other elements that the only way to sometimes reproduce it would be by backtracks. So I think if it's done intelligently and creatively and artistically, it should be acceptable. I think that if it's a vice so that someone isn't singing what they did in the studio or someone isn't playing what they did in the studio. That's a different deal. I don't agree with that. Um, anyways, so there you go. There's my opinion on the whole backtracking system that's out there. And a lot of bands do it, uh, especially the younger generation bands, the younger demographic. They're, they're playing tons of backing tracks. It's unbelievable how much they use. Um, but as far as your, your, uh, your friends, um, would you say images of Eden? Let me see. Uh, what is it? Yeah. Images of Eden. And they were kicked off the, uh, the wasp tour. Well, I don't know what the hell happened there, but, uh, all right. Yeah. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. And they must've been, uh, really, um, upset for sure. Um, but I will say that, uh, let me see. So there's, so to Gordon, Steve, Eric, Carlos, and Dean. Um, hey guys, you have to persevere. I mean, this industry, man, woo, there's a lot of knocks upside the head and it's only the strong that will survive, you know, easier said than done. Right. But seriously, I mean, my, my son's in a band called Falset, F-A-L-S-E-T. I mean, hey, they're having to go through the same stuff and the same rigors and the same, you know, adversaries uh, that present themselves from day to day, being in a band, trying to get on a tour, trying to get your stuff heard, getting the streams up to a point where it actually will constitute many people in the audience there for you. Um, so it's, it's a tough gig. It's, it's a really, really tough gig to be a professional musician and to really make something of it and then to be able to retain it and to keep it going, to have longevity. And that's one of the blessings with Dream Theaters. We've been doing this for, oh, wow, like 35 plus years, even more. Um, so, uh, you know, so anyways, guys, um, like I said, Gordon, Steve, Eric, Dean Carlos, right? Yeah. Okay. My eyes are horrible. Um, anyways, all the best guys. You keep going for it. Hold your head up, heads up and, um, just do it, man. I mean, it's, it's unfortunate that happened to you guys, but Hey, you guys know who and what you are. And so 
you know, you got to just keep moving forward, put that behind you and just knock it up to an unfortunate set of circumstances. Um, but anyways, all the best to you guys and agent of the sink army, uh, all the best to you. And, uh, Hey, hope you guys, uh, are well and all the best in life and everything else that goes with it. Okay. Bye-bye.